Hey everybody, Dr. Delvai here from HTV Speaks. How are you? So listen, my friend Priya asked me if I would do a very short video on how I use my devices on my room or on my chair. I have a Permobile 300 chair and I love this phone. This is the um, this is the Pixel 4 phone that I love and I think it's, uh, it has great word activation. Okay Google, play music. And I also forgot that I have my uh, Bluetooth on, so I gotta turn that off. So it's a little combination of really just um, using voice activation and I will have to touch, so that's uh, my phone where I like it. I also have the iPad 12. I'm confusing my poor camera person here on that because we already had a plan, but anyway, so this is the iPad Pro that I have and it's uh, put on by a Permobile iPad holder. And so, um, so what I do is uh, I'm a multitasker, okay? And so I, um, as you can see, my phone is going crazy, but um, I'm a multitasker, so this is, I, I love this iPad Pro. I love how easy it is to use. You know, I'm still learning from it as far as doing YouTube videos. I don't have the dimmer on right now, so the night, is that coming in dark clear or is it coming out okay? It's coming out okay. Okay, cool. So yeah, so this is why I love doing this. So so again, I use a little bit of both things, of both voice activation and of uh, texting. And like I'll go on Messenger, I'm in a conversation right now, and I can you know just put it on voice and say, hello, how are you today? Question mark, good. And I'm sure a lot of my peers probably use uh, the same thing. And again, it's typing away, I just leave it there and it does that. The only difficult thing about that is that it doesn't always get it right. Okay, so what I do like about what Messenger is doing, they give you an option to do these one minute voice pieces. And I love that because now what you will get is a recording of me talking to you for about one minute. And this is so much easier. I just forget to use it a lot of times, you know, and I'll, I'll be there typing away or, or speaking, you know, and it's making all these mistakes and people are like, what, you know? <laughs> So I have offended some people as well too, by mistake of course. Um, but anyway, so that's that. That's how I use this, uh, my iPad Pro. And like I said, I use a, a combination of voice and also texting. The phone is the same way. And then on that, if you just get right in front of me again, of course you can scan the room and let people get an idea of what my room is like and what it has in it. You know, to the two far corners there, just, just uh, to the right corner is my family, to the center of the wall. It's pretty much my life story. Uh, where have I been, where I'm going, where I still want to be. And of course, the other corner over there is drones. Uh, this corner right behind me, though, and that we're going to be uh, shooting me from, is, uh, is my workbench a little bit. And uh, I don't know, I guess you could say I'm a speaker, writer, you know, all that, advocate, social worker. And so, uh, so I do a lot of talking with technology. I'm paralyzed from the chest down. And uh, so I tilt back a lot of times for meditation. And Alexa is the one that helps you with that. So you probably see a blue light on Alexa, she's probably gonna say some stuff. Okay, so you gotta be very careful when you mention her name in here, or if you just mention a name that's similar to her name, she might wanna know what's going on. So uh, again, how I use my technology, and, uh, and and the iPad, and I both, I also have a computer. If you could just shoot underneath the desk there, Lynette, I'll show you my computer. And I use a keyboard that's right there. The only uh, um, trouble with that desk is that it's not high up enough for me. And so I don't very really use it as much, uh, other than if my iPad is giving me problems, then I will go on my computer and use that. And um, I don't know, maybe you could just hit the little house on the thing. At one time, I had her, you know her name, um, I would just, uh, no, no, uh, Lynette, just the uh, little house on the remote. And so, so at one time I had, you know, who uh, just say, you know, turn on my TV or turn off, my, turn on my computer and it would just come on. So now I'm, I'm dependent back on a, uh, on a remote for that. But um, it just makes my room easier to be in. Uh, I enjoy every, you know, where everything is at. I know where everything is at and my nurses know where everything is at. So whenever I use something, I just like to have it put back to where it's at. Of course, my nurses would probably say I'm a real pain in the ass about that, but it's who I am these days. So anyway, back to, uh, to my friend behind me. Does she have a blue light? No. Okay, so um, so one of the things I love to do when I come into my room and I just 
I've been working. Uh, I, you know, I work out as well. I got a little homemade gym and a patio. Is I just like to come back here and tilt all the way back, of course. And then, um, Alexa, give me a five minute meditation. Welcome to five minute meditation. This five minute meditation. Alexa, turn up the volume to see. Can reduce nervousness before events, such as interviews, beginning a new job or school, or dealing with everyday stress. Alexa, situation. stop. Thanks for listening. Alexa, turn on my left light. A few things share the name my left light. Which one did you want? Left light. Okay. And on my ceiling fan, I'm still working on that to be a, a smart switch. I just haven't made it a smart switch yet because I usually been using a remote for it for so long. Um, I haven't made it smart. My plan, of course, is to make the whole house smart. Um, but smart, it could be expensive. You know, you got to buy all these plugs. Um, but they're they're coming up with some new technology that's even uh, is even getting better with that. So that gives you a little idea about me and the work I do in my room, the way I do use Alexa. Alexa, how do you say Johnny got back in Spanish? Yeah, that didn't happen. All right, uh, so I, I use it like when I'm, I'm having to write some stuff in Spanish. Um, I ask her for the interpretation if I don't know it, despite the fact that I am.